हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू वेस्टम कॉर्नर यर आई एम शेयरिंग विद यू जोग्रफी नाइन्थ स्टैंडर्ड फॉर चैप्टर क्वेश्चन आंसर्स सो लेट सी हाउ आर द टिक मार्किंग्स सो यर इज द फर्स्ट चैप्टर नेम इज डिस्ट्रीब्यूशनल मैप्स आई विल बी एक्सप्लेनिंग अबाउट द आंसर्स टू इन दिस वीडियो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई विल बी गिविंग यू क्वेश्चन आंसर्स इक मार्किंग ऑफ दिस चैप्टर so let's move on to our question sheet of this chapter and that will be at the end of uh, the chapter in this textbook of first distributional maps uh, when we say about distributional maps uh, these maps are of some kind which show distribution of various variables in a particular region and these are of three types first is thematic maps second dot map third is chloroplast map and fourth is isoplast map uh, first map thematic map is doesn't considered in this just only three maps just as dot method chloroplast method and isoplast method is taught in this first chapter so we will be finding out the answers of these three types of methods so the first one give reasons why following sentences are right or wrong first question the main aim of distributional map is to show location now in this give reasons why following sentences are right or wrong you have to write that whether the sentence is right or wrong and also you have to mention the reasons uh, which will be of two or four lines so i will be giving you uh, two to four lines explanation of the reason will uh, for the first question it is on page number 1 and this statement is wrong so you should write the main aim of distributional map is to show location this statement is wrong and then you should write the reason which is mentioned on the page number 1 i will be showing you of that let's move on to page number 1 to get this answer our second question in chloroplast maps only one value is assigned to the sub administrative unit so this statement is right and whether it is right or wrong you have to state the reasons uh, and that's the and that's why i have mentioned here both the questions so that you can easily understand that whether the statement is right or wrong you have to mention the reason properly as per this text so now we are uh, moving towards to find the answer of first reason uh, the statement was the main aim of distributional map is to show regions so the answer is in the yellow box i will be tick marking it so please note that it's in the yellow box uh, these maps are useful to explain the distribution of these variables in the region yellow box second paragraph this right hand towards these maps are start ho raha hai end ho raha hai shown in the following uh, end ho raha hai data of the variables the just this much reason you have to write for the first point first question now we will see the second question isoplast method uh, the second question reason will be also shown to you so first of all let's check the question in a chloroplast maps only one value is assigned to the sub administrative unit this statement is right and the page number is page number 3 so second question page number 3 reasons so we will move on to page number 3 to get the reason of uh, second question it's into the isoplast method heading in starting with in these and ending till etc here is the isoplast method here is isoplast method heading under this heading this the reason is hidden over sorry it was chloroplast map so you have to mention the point of chloroplast map not isoplast map so you have to study that answer the heading chloroplast method 
under that point the paragraph tick marked that one you have to study for the second question now we will see the third question this is also related to pluripath method therefore this will be also on page number 3 but this uh, question is wrong statement is wrong so we will find out the answer for the same so under the heading of pluripath map method we will see about that the reasons of question number 3 starting from the smallest ending till white patterns 1.3 question reason this answer is of reason of question number 1.3 note it down properly so that you can uh, don't forget the answers whether which one was of 1.2 and which was one of 1.3 now we will move on to 1.4 hmm fourth question chloroplast maps are used to show altitudes this statement is wrong and the reason is in page number 3 itself actually isoplast maps are used to show altitudes not chloroplast maps so we will write here properly but with respect to the textbook given headings So now we will move on to page number three. The statement was wrong. The chloroplast maps do not show about the altitude. Isoplast maps show about the altitude. So we will write the answer as per the heading of isoplast method, uh, starting from the first paragraph in these maps, ending till etc. Starting from in these maps under the isoplast method heading. in these maps and ending till etc this is a 1.4 now we will move on to the question number 5 which whether the statement is right or wrong so let's read out that question number 5 is isoplast maps are used to show population distribution this statement is wrong actually dot maps are used to show population distribution so you have to write the reason from the dot method heading 1.5 question answer so now we will see about the question number 6 7 and 8 question number 6 will be in this textbook itself in this video but uh, question number 7 and 8 i have written in some other format so that you can get the proper answer uh sixth question is right and the reason is on page number 1 the same dot method under the heading of dot method the reason of question number 6 is hidden so let's see what's the reason we have to start with the second paragraph of dot method to do that no not to do that we have to start with the lowest and the highest values and end till scale of the map the lowest and highest values until scale of the map this is 1.6 this is the reason of question number 1.6 for 7th and 8th question i have prepared a new slide so refer to that itself 
because some of the points are missing from this textbook and i have to i have arranged some of the points in the such a manner to write that answer to write the question of that uh, to write the answer of that question so please refer that itself so here is a slide mentioned for question number 1.7 Uh, isobaric maps are not made using isolines this statement is wrong and the reason is correct statement is isobaric maps are made by using isolines reason are here itself so by uh, looking this slide you can just imagine how to write the paper how to write the answer first you have to write whether the statement is right or wrong then you have to write the correct statement and then you have to mention the reasons so the reason is mentioned over here you can just note it down in your notebook this is 1.7 and answer uh, and below this it there is 1.8 question number answer distribution of various geographical elements can be shown using dot method this statement is wrong and the correct statement is distribution of only continuous geographical elements can be shown using dot method so the reason is given below now about the answer in brief question number 2 it is also mentioned by slide itself answer in brief question number 1 explain the use and types of distribution maps in this you have to mention the types of distribution maps as we discussed earlier in distribution maps there are three types chloroplet dot and isoplet so i have mentioned one and paragraph for each and with their examples so you have to study this so talking about moving about the second question differentiate between chloroplet map and isoplet maps i was not able to draw the diagram uh, table but i have mentioned in one paragraph each three three points each of one concept about chloroplet map there are three points as compared to isoplet maps so isoplet maps is mentioned below with three points as compared to chloroplet map so these two paragraphs you have to study for the differentiate between Uh, moving towards question number three, explain with reasons the method which is best suited to show the distribution of population in a region. So, two point three question answer. Uh, this is dot method which is best suited. So, these are three points you have to study and write the answer. Answer in brief question number three. So, till then, these were all the answers from the textbook and from the arranged answers in from the textbook itself, not from other notebooks. So, uh, till then. like subscribe and share my channel to get more such videos and interesting ones to study easily and quickly so till then be attentive towards the classes or else you don't have any of them then then watch my channel videos which i share to you there are question many question answers i will be sharing so till then like subscribe and share my channel uh, stay safe stay home bye bye